detailed architecture overview now see here this is see first thing is sale point is a bab based tool okay when i'm saying bab based software which means it deploy on the application server or the bab server clear now our application server in training we will be using tomcat as a application server 95% of real organizations real client uses same tomcat as a application server now you will say why the sale point says if you use a tomcat we will provide you all the help because we are taking sale point as a default and it will work smoothly for a tomcat it will work for jboss and babspare as well but we are considering if you use a tomcat we will provide all the help which we can do okay so sale point provide full support for tomcat if you are using a tomcat if you stuck somewhere the sale point say our implementations our architecture will help you to configure the each and everything okay but if you are using a babspare or jboss you need to hire your separate jboss or babspare developer clear or not yes sir okay so that's why 95% of the client uses the tomcat as a application server yes so when we take the license of uh, shell point they by default they going to give tomcat right or maybe we... Tom tomcat is a free software so you okay. can directly uh, use the apache tomcat you can directly download it okay that is the free okay. software okay open source clear okay. and start. why uh, see we... many for... yes can we use in uh, cloud is it possible Sorry? to install yes is yes see yes yes for application server see what would happens you need to configure whole application server on cloud and then you can install the cloud as well but for there you need to separately the sale point does not suggest anything sale point says this is our tool iiq is on premises tool okay sale point says we have a separate tool called identity now for a cloud but if you want to use on the cloud you can use it this is a particular software which you need to store it somewhere okay and this is the application server so if you you are using your own cloud software you can use it that's not a problem clear sunil yeah okay now coming back to that uh, yes nine okay now what is the uh, database server so we need three things here one is database server one is application server and one is software the software will be provided by the sale point application server uh, this is a tomcat you can use jboss and uh, babspare as well database server by default they provide a configuration with mysql but they are already providing the whole configuration for oracle ms sql and db2 as well okay so it's up to the organizations they want to use because uh, many of the organization don't use the mysql that is friendly uh, that is a uh, fact that they don't use the because database is the one thing which is uh, highly confidential and all those things so they don't use the uh, the mysql they use the ms sql or oracle okay sale point say by default configuration is configuration is for mysql but we are providing all scripts and data for oracle ms sql which is a microsoft sql server and db2 and mysql is already there clear this four for this four they provide the configuration whole configuration okay by default configuration is mysql and they provide all these three database as well now they say if you want to use any other database you need to write your own script 
you can take a reference of oracle mysql and db2 and you need to create your own table we are not going to provide the tables the script okay clear clear or not yes Mohit. okay good so now now coming back to the architecture overview see here this is our application server which is the tomcat the sale point provide the identity iq software i will provide to you that will install on your application server that software contain all the api ui task and all those things it contain one hibernate file okay this is the important hibernate file actually tell to iq that which database i need to interact okay whether it is a mysql whether it is a oracle which actually database i need to interact so this hibernate file connect to the database server and database server can be used a mysql oracle and then in the mysql you need to create a table identity iq table which actually connect with the the application server or this identity iq application and then we have different different target system like csb jdbc ad lab and those would be connected with the applications or connectors clear and you can configure a separate email server or you can do the same email server on the uh, the same server local host you can configure on the same local host as well if you want to separate out you can separate out as well things are clear architecture overview is clear or not yes no so one we install this uh, shell point schemas going to store in db or we need to create the source schemas or no need to any schema for this no no we we need to create a schema see here in database server you are seeing one identity iq database right here yeah, yeah. So this database would be created when you will um, uh, when either you will create uh, import the script or you will create the schema right and the schema will provided by the sale point for all four database as I told you MySQL Oracle DB2 and the MS SQL sale point say if you are using any of the four we are going to provide a schema for all four okay whatever you want to install if you are using mysql use import the mysql schema if you are using oracle use the oracle schema if you are using ms sql ms sql and you need to import that schema into your particular database clear yeah got it okay so these are the things on the detail architecture view 